I'm not 26. I'm gonna be 41 in a few weeks. I don't understand. Then let me explain. Season four picks up right when season three ended. We're really dealing with the immediate aftermath of Kelsey discovering who Liza really is and what she's been doing all this time. And I think it really rocks her world. Why even tell me now? Because I couldn't keep deceiving the people I love most. I think that's all I can deal with for one night. Kelsey and Liza are gonna go through a tough time. You know, like any relationship that feels betrayed, there, there's going to be some healing and some arguments and some getting real with each other in a way that that's, we've never seen on the show before. We're millennials and our brand is young and fun. So I'm gonna need you to be a little more on brand. Keep up. Kelsey and Josh are definitely finding solace in each other right now. They're the only two people that really understand what each one is going through. Who is she? Hmm. Like, do I even know her at all? It's like you know her and you don't. And I think the question is, where does that lead? And how does that relationship deepen? And where does that relationship go? There will be other men in Liza's life besides Josh and Charles. They're still really important characters in Liza's life. And I think part of Liza's dilemma is, as any character who's in love with two people at the same time, that's a problem. Why did you have to kiss him? I don't know. Some part of me needed to blow things up. The show isn't really about a premise. It's about these characters. And certainly it's about how Liza is making her way in the world with this lie, but the lie changes and her relationships with people change based on what they know about her. And uh, the characters' relationships with each other are in constant change right now, especially in season four.